Number one is you must take ownership for everything that happens. Because now if you are your own boss, or really what I want their listeners to think about is stepping into being an entrepreneur. So if you want to be an entrepreneur and not just your own boss, you must take ownership for Mm. everything. You're responsible for everything. Here's what happens. The reason why this is so important is because a lot of people, they don't, they, they want to be their own boss, but they also don't want any responsibility for anything. Sure. Like, well, and, and people say that to us, right? Like you deal with a lot of people who are like, well, I don't make as much money as I would like. Well, I it, anything that they're not happy about, but they work for themselves. Yes. So right. they don't take ownership for it. Right. And then they're looking for solutions on the outside. So anything that you do, that comes to mind because we hear oftentimes people you know, have things go wrong in their business. It's not turning out how they like. And it's so easy to try to blame it on the company that you hired to help you. But if you're your own boss, you effectively made that decision for one reason or the other. If you don't feel like your dollars are spent properly and you can't pay yourself enough, oftentimes it's because you made that decision where those dollars go. And it's really easy to, you know, try to not look at it and say that is because of the pivots and the decisions that I made. Here's the thing. When we're looking to work with somebody, we always are looking for the admission that whatever is going wrong in your business. And I don't mean like wildly wrong. A lot of people come to us because there's just slight corrections that they want to make. But whatever is happening in your business, both good and both bad, are ultimately your responsibility. 